Mm-hmm. I think that's what I was thinking too. I think you, in your own way, you broke the mold. You see, sometimes we gotta like, that's what I think one of our biggest things is for Ronnie and Kevin with our recaps. Like, we wanna just, like, you deserve living legends. That's what that is. That's a thing. And we don't, like, it seems for some reason we waiting for, I like, that's why I like Norby. Get them roses now. Yeah. Like, what are we talking about? He's made that a very popular thing because people weren't saying that before. Now it's like a regular phrase. Like, nice. give me my rose, give me my flowers and mm-hmm. that type shit. I love that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, a lot of people deserve it. Everybody in their own right when you really think about it. But it's like, like seriously, like even that defines your career a lot of ways too, I'm thinking, because it opens the door for everybody else who feels like an outsider. Like, we, if this is a, you know, we're going to leave, we going to pro. We spoke about if we're going to bring this up, but this is a concept we have, right? We want to do a show. We try to do, like, we, we making a few battle rap shows. Like, there's not just one thing, like cartoons. But there's something like, you with the like bring this is a real thing, like the LGBTQ community now. Seeing J2 and all that stuff coming up, like you got a lot of even like the females. They this is they, they, there's a lot of them out there, so I'm like, I want to do something there. But then on the other side, let's show that drama and then let's use that to unite. And the point that I'm saying with you, because I like this is the thing, I would I figured I was gonna be introducing this to battle rap and like kind of showing like, yo, we need to really stop the nonsense. This is ridiculous. To even all this, we don't, if you don't, no, nobody ever cared about what anybody else is doing behind the scenes. As long as they don't bring it to you, like, anyway, like, let people be who they are. Yeah. And, like, the whole thing, that's why I support, like, J2 and all these other people. Everybody, the second somebody says I'm kicking them out, like, my whole thing is, like, I support them. Mm-hmm. I don't think, because I kind of feel like the same way. I have my own, I was, like, the shitty shit staying motherfucker around. Mm-hmm. And had to, like, fight my way through it my own way. And it kept the chip on my shoulder. But I opened up. I seen how it opened up the way for new other new people, like, cause I was from. Um, they called me the, the the Caribbean. I was up in Guyana, up in Guyana. Mm-hmm. So it was like everybody else started coming over from different from from um, Caribbean places. They didn't get that same treatment because yeah, you know, it's that was not. Like, he's like one of us, so you can't even play that game mm-hmm. anymore. So I, that story like symbolizes that a lot for me, man. That's powerful. I love that. I love that even expressing it like that. And like one thing now with this with the battle rap energy, I've been trying. I got a list here. I've been trying to figure out all of your battles because once you said you're trying to do hundred battles, I'm like, all right, yeah, nah, that's fine. Yeah. That's fine. That's fine. You so it's that's a, camera. That's on camera. That, yeah, that's not really the fault, but yeah. Yeah, yeah nah, girl. Yeah. Come on, man. That's like, where, where do you, <laughs> where do you, where do you place yourself? I don't like. I like to ask this question for like multiple reasons. First of all, let me just be honest, because I don't like to use the word um, Rock Mount Rushmore because the Native Americans, that was, it's called the, the Six Grandfathers Mountain. Okay. That was six Native Americans who was literally honored in that mountain and it was taken and they put the, For real? that's the story, that's the reality, yeah, yeah. that's Mount Rushmore. Yeah, I know. And they put their, these four faces on it to take it over, but still to this day, Natives look at that area as sacred land. Mm-hmm. That, they don't care about that area right there. Right. But on, and I love it too because I think we need more than four. Like if you think about it now, and I say we gotta do it, we definitely gotta do it in the errors, but it's not just in errors, like think about what the person, it's like what path you, you set up. It's not just about everybody can rap. I love when you said that. You gotta what what else is more to your life that you gotta bring in with, with the path, your story. With the bars and the fact that you're still going with that track record, when you break this down, like I'm, t- like I don't know, I want to really know how you. I don't feel like a lot of a lot of rappers really like talk about that. Like, how do you feel about yourself personally? Like, your, your own opinion about um, that. I feel like, like I said, I feel like I'm one of the best rapping right now. Right now, I feel like rap or, or, or even lyricism doesn't have an age limit. I feel like maybe your marketability does, or maybe, um, you know, there is a new energy when you're new, that, you know, it's like what we say, your first impression should not your last impression, because when you meet somebody new and you introduce, you can gain a following real quick. Mm-hmm. But there's a lot of people that have come in the game before me, during, or even after, that might have passed me, but they fell off. Mm-hmm. At least I can say I've stayed here, and I've always stayed here, mm-hmm. you know, and that's fit. And you can't, you can't um, really. That, that's a testament to to, mm-hmm. to to time, you know. Um, a lot of people don't know how to stay relevant. A lot of people don't have the passion mm-hmm. to stay good, to stay good or stay great, you know. And sometimes you can't repeat, you know, moments. 
but you can still create new ones, you know, mm -hmm. and, and people sometimes try to live in the past or try to, you know, like, my highland hand battle, I'm never going to have a battle like that again. You just have to accept it. Mm -hmm. Keep trying to outdo that. Like, yeah. nigga, it's not going <laughs> to happen. You know what I'm saying? It's just head ice. It's just not going to happen. Yeah. Sometimes when you start that high, you're chasing that high, and, mm -hmm. and you know, you can't get too wrapped up in that. You just have to, like, stay focused. So for me, I look at myself as I'm one of the best rapping right now. I feel like I rap better than 90% of the game. Not just battle rap, but 90% of the game. I can rap better than you. Whether it equates to money is a whole different thing. But as far as the actual skill, you can't fuck with me like that. Mm -hmm.